So we're starting to get a lot of information about Marvel Snap and we've just had some information about the card rarity and also the progression system of cards. This was in the live stream that Second Dinner did a few days ago. I'll link to it in the description of this video. So all cards in the game have got roughly the same rarity but when you first receive any given card in the game it will be a common level and you can progress that card and you can progress its cosmetics. It is a cosmetic only change. When it's a common card, I believe it has this whitish gray border. They've not actually been explicitly clear on like the colors of all of the different levels. So I'm gonna to have to do a little bit of guesswork during this video. But anyway, it starts as a white or gray border and the artwork is held within it. Now, when you play cards and start using them, this is when they start progressing. So I assume they accumulate experience. Now, in the original reveal stream, we saw this really cool uh, thing that happened where it came up like frame break and like Hulk sort of smashed out of the, the borders. Frame break. And the artwork expands beyond the borders. Now, this is the first progression, which is uncommon. I believe uncommon is the turquoise bordered ones. Anyway, so you keep progressing the card. So when you go from uncommon, you move up to rare. And with rare, you get a 3D sort of parallax uh, effect is how they described it. But when you like uh, either rotate the phone or, or pinch and move around it, you get this cool 3D effect of the character in the background. Then you move from rare up to epic. And when you get epic, you get cool animations don't exactly know what this is or what this looks like we have seen it uh, but not well rather I should say I, I may have seen it in the various videos I've watched but not recognize exactly what it is then when you progress from epic you move up to legendary and with legendary the logo apparently becomes shiny now when you progress from legendary you go up to ultra um, and then there's a level above ultra as well which is inf infinite or infinity now I don't know which color is which here there's like this shimmery shiny red border and the shimmery shiny uh, sort of indigo border now when it goes ultra that's when it gets an animated border so looks extra cool but infinity is the one that sounds really really incredible so when it goes infinity or when it when it levels up to infinity the card splits and it creates a um or rather two common copies of itself but crucially with a new and awesome effect so they said that it could be like a shiny holographic so i think we've seen some cards which has got this sort of rainbow holographic background so i believe that is an infinity split off version of the card but you get these two uh, i think they said two copies and then because they start off a common again you can then level them up and progress them through the card ranks again uh, up, up until when it gets to infinity again it will split again and you can have multiple card effects um on the copies this is something that I'm so interested in. I'm so excited um, to see what this even looks like. So obviously your favourite cards, if you keep using them over and over, you're going to go uh, infinity multiple times and get multiple copies with multiple different effects. I assume it's got a max out at some point. So I'm guessing maybe eventually you'll get like a, I don't know, maybe you'd get a golden, fully golden copy or platinum or diamond, something like that. I don't know, something really cool. But I'm guessing once you've maxed out a card and it's got like all possible effects I, like there has to be an end point is what I'm saying right so thank you very much for watching this first uh, proper video on res snapper this channel I hope you enjoyed it subscribe I'm gonna be streaming on twitch twitch.tv slash res snapper I hope that you enjoy the game as much as I think I'm going to I haven't played it at this moment in time uh, I'm hopefully gonna get into the beta I've signed up for the beta I'm you know crossing all fingers that I'm actually gonna get into it and I hope that you'll join me on my journey thank you mm -hmm.